Low back pain is one of the most common health problems that will impact someone in this country. So millions of people are impacted by this on a yearly basis. Currently, we don't have a good treatment option for back pain. So the holy grail of research when it comes to degenerative disc disease is trying to find a method of either retarding disc degeneration or potentially reversing the degenerative process. Our research is looking at simvastatin, which is a common cholesterol lowering medication. And uh, besides its use in cholesterol, we think there, there's another application it can be used for, and that, that's in uh, uh, retarding or reversing the degenerative process for the intervertebral disc. One of the issues we've had with injecting a medication such as simvastatin in the disc space is it's liable to diffuse away uh, fairly rapidly without some means of maintaining it within the disc space, which is where we want the drug to work. So one, one way of working around that problem we've uh, developed is using a carrier, a hydrogel carrier in this circumstance. And so the carrier will maintain a drug in, in the disc space for a period of time and release it slowly, say a month or two, rather than uh, have it diffuse away within a matter of minutes. So this is basically a three chamber system. So the first two syringes have um, gel components. And then the third syringe had a drug uh, within, in a saline solution. So once you mix the gel component, you take one uh, syringe off and you add the other uh, drug component and you mix it to make the final drug compound. It's years off. Currently, we are in large animal studies and hopefully uh, once that gets accomplished and we can show efficacy, that would move to a human trial. The attractiveness of this uh, medication is we're trying to maintain, the, you know, basically the natural motion and function of the uh, of the disc space and relieve the pain. So, I, you know, it would be very, very advantageous and I, I think very appealing for most uh, most folks. And it's a minimal invasive procedure, right? It's, it's a, just an injection into the disc space versus a big incision with surgery, all the pain you have with it. Um, so there's a lot of advantages to this type of treatment.